We, if we just wanted to eat food and live a normal life, we could just eat chapati and dal. Then why do we have all these burgers, pizzas, pastas, and all these other stuff? It's because it brings us pleasure. It, bring, it gives us happiness. We're looking for happiness. Like my sister. I don't know. I said to you want to join? Let's go. Let's go. I don't like to Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Some other activities that we say for happiness are... Okay. Thank you so much for um, attending the first session. The second session is... <laughs> is does God exist? So do you think does God exists? Today I'm going to take the atheist out of you. <laughs> Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Do you think God exists? Well, I'm going to take the atheist out of you. Keep going. Keep going. Keep, keep, keep going. Keep going. So now it's the most fundamental question. Does God exist? What do you think, Part Prabhu? <laughs> Yes, God exists. Where is the proof? <laughs> Do any of you have proof? Anyone in the audience? That's why we sing one Your proof part, Prabhu? Uh, think. <laughs> Anyone of you have proof? Yeah, I have proof. Somebody Prabhu has. Your proof is. Okay. No, the proof is. The relationship with greater. <laughs> hey, get, 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 get down, get down from there. There is a key below. There is a key below. The Who key made break. this rock? Can you just lift it and remove the key from below? Just God only made it. God the proof that God made it. Whenever. So now, in this, in, now we're going to learn about creation implies a creator. So now, someone, per se, someone wow. made a, 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 someone made a paint. Then. The, does the paint come by itself? No, someone makes it. Some, someone makes the paint. So, a creation implies a creator. So that means even this universe has been created, right? That means it implies a creator too. Who do you think that creator is? God! God! So that's how we know God exists. Thank you so much for attending the, the second session of <laughs> our now we have the third session. Hey, yeah. I'm sorry, but it's late. No, Satya Prabhu is shouting. Prabhu is shouting. Prashadam, Prashadam. Satya Prabhu. It's very late. It's very late. Very late, come out. The Prasadam is. There's no Prasadam every day. Sorry. <laughs> hey, Krishna. Okay, uh, today, <laughs> today, today we are going to be speaking about the third session. Which is? You know, I believe in scriptures. You know what yes. is Satya Prabhuji's new style? Next time session continues, I bring Prashad like this. Hare Krishna. Satya Prabhuji is starting a buffet. No, no, I'll take it, Prashad. You have a little come. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Woo! Woo! Silence. No, she's with Alakarte because she's bringing him to them. Yeah, good, good, good. So, why believe in scriptures? Anyone has a, any points about the topic? What do you expect that someone... Does anyone have any obligations about scriptures? Objection, Your Honor! What's your objection? I don't have any objection. Order in the court! We have an eighth... Uh, area. Come on, tell, why do we believe in scriptures? Come on, go ahead. We have to believe in scriptures because they come through parampara and parampara is a dis disciplinic succession. And? Uh, go look in the dictionary. <laughs> so now, some of the proofs. We need proof, right? In yeah. science, we don't believe anything without proof. 
We need to scientifically prove it. So even scriptures has wait, proof. Wait, you have an advertisement? <laughs> Anyone who would like a part of Bhagavatam, please come to Prerna Waldorf School on this Wednesday. It's a Gita Jayanti and an Ekadashi. If you haven't got your Bhagavatam already, what are you doing? Go buy it. Prabhuji. Yes, Shah Prabhuji is going to give our Bhagavatams. Please come. No, give it out. It's not for free, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Some proofs are, in the scriptures, even though the scriptures were written more than 5,000 years ago, it was something which was written, which is known as Bhugol, which means round earth. And this was, this was written 5,000 years ago. There were no spacecrafts or satellites that time, but they still knew. So that is a proof that okay. we should believe can, in Can you give Sumed, Sumed for some time? Sumed. Go ahead, come on, come on, come on. In the Bhagavatam, there are many proofs that in Kali Yuga, water will be sold and food will be sold and soon air will be sold. So far, a lot of these predictions have come true. So we can conclude that scriptures are real. Haribo! The scriptures has also predicted the appearance of Lord Chaitanya, Lord Buddha, and Srila Prabhupada too. Haribo! <laughs> Thank you for coming to the session. Today also there is no prasadam due to inconvenience. Please buy your Bhagavatam. You have a you have a few days left. Please think about it and don't worry, it's not free. No. Madhi, is that is that what you were saying on the phone? Yeah, for the one one place. <laughs> Oh, Wait, thank you. That is the end of the third session. Now, yeah. now fourth Hare session. Fourth session. Welcome to the fourth session. Every sit down. Sit down. Everybody sit down. Welcome to the fourth session. The fourth session is why do I need a guru? You might think, oh my God, I don't need a guru. Well, listen to part no more. Wow. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, who is a guru? Question. Teacher, teacher, spiritual teacher. Teacher. Bala, bala, India, Lata. No, he's saying he's the guru. Who's the guru? <laughs> 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 Anyone who has answers? What do you say? What do you say? Krishna. Haribol. Haribol. Guru is a person who guides. It doesn't have to all be spiritual, it can be material. Anyone, even a teacher. Math teacher, anything? Yeah, but teacher. Teacher. Oh, Any teacher? Example, Nirupa Mataji. Yes. Haribo! <laughs> Anyone can be a guru. But, guru... But, let, let me. Hold on that sentence. Did you just say anyone can be a guru? Oh, no. Oh my, oh my god. god, he's getting on. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Well, not everyone can be a guru. There are many gurus on the black market <laughs> by getting money to teach fake news. Has anyone seen that before? <laughs> you, you understand now why they're in trouble in school. Right? Anyone can't be a guru. Explain why, what the quality of debate. This is an SSR session. No, go ahead, go ahead. You, you tell the answer. I'm very eager to hear. Yeah. So who can be a guru? Someone who gives the right knowledge without a cost for your own benefit is a guru. Haribo. Haribo. Correction for everybody's benefit. This is not an example. So now, thank you so much for coming to the fourth session. What's your question, security? About Ekalavya's thumb, this was a pastime, number one. Krishna wanted this to happen because um, scriptures explain that Ekalavya was a Nishada. And Nishada. <laughs> He is from a Nishada dynasty. Nishada is Prashada's brother. No! <laughs> he, and also, he was a very, um, since there was, he, 
Krishna did not want any inconvenience for Arjuna, so that's why they... No, all of you sit. When, when, when one is speaking, everybody sit down. One is speaking, everybody sit down. When, so he, so in the past time, Guru Drona cuts Ekalavya's thumb for that. But still, Ekalavya was able to um, use the bow with his middle finger. Okay, how, how can we acquire spiritual knowledge? We can acquire spiritual knowledge only by a guru. E even if we read the Shri Bhagavatam, we will not understand the true meaning under it. So now there are three yeah. types of gurus. Yes. We <laughs> forgot the three types. <laughs> <laughs> good one, good one, good one. Siksha Guru, Diksha Guru, and Vardhamana Pradiksha Guru. Yeah, Vardhamana Pradiksha Guru. Yes, so now yes. So these three types of Gurus. Haribo! Vardhamana Pradiksha Guru is the Guru who introduces you to something new. A Shiksha Guru. So who, who is your Vardhamana Pradiksha Guru? My parents. Haribo! Haribo. Haribo. <laughs> yes. And then the Shiksha Guru is the person who 